Happening right now, the city and county of Honolulu is holding a press conference about an incident involving a city ambulance. Our Jeremy Lee is joined us now from live from the scene at Adventist Health Castle with the details. Jeremy. Well, it's been an emotional night here at Adventist Health Castle and just beyond me there's still a very active scene where one of the EMS ambulances is uh, being heavily examined right now. An explosion. People are perplexed. Personnel from the hospital say they've never seen anything like this. This is what they said earlier to press just moments ago. The patient that's deceased and for the paramedic that's been injured in the line of duty. Um, we will make sure that there's an investigation and try and determine, work with the Honolulu Fire Department and Police Department to determine what happened and so that we can understand why and to you know take whatever steps are necessary to keep something like this from happening again. Otherwise, at this time, that's all we know and we'll follow up at a later time. Thank you. Thanks, Chief. Um, you know, I, I, I don't have a lot more to say. I think I can take a few questions. I may not be able to answer them. Um, but if you have any, I'd be happy to try to answer them. But again, um, this just happened. It's a very um, difficult situation for us. Um, and, and we're all just very, very concerned about our team and, of course, the patient who lost their life tonight in the ambulance. Dr. Ireland, one thing that happens when a patient is transported to Straub, there's a burn unit there. Can you comment on what the extent of the injuries might be with the paramedic who was taken there? You know, I, I don't really want to get into the injuries. He is in critical condition. Um, all our, our, our paramedics and EMTs, dispatchers, are all treasured members of our, of our staff and our family. They save lives every day. And, I, and again, it's just very hard to be in this situation where where, where our team is the ones who are injured. So I'll just leave it at that, but um, please pray for him. Those details just coming in and you can hear the emotion in people's voices because this is an active ambulance that was coming in to Bay with a patient and the patient has uh, been, uh, has expired, is deceased at this point injuries to uh, the personnel, to the driver. So um, it is a very active scene here and it is with heavy hearts that uh, those medical personnel came to, uh, to speak with us just now as these details continue to come in. Keep it here at KITV4. We're gonna send it back to you in the studio.